Well, summer is the busiest time of year for the Sioux Falls bike trail system. And starting this weekend, users may notice a change. Kelloland's Carly Phillips tells us about the addition of Class 2 e-bikes and what rules riders need to know. This Saturday, Class 2 e-bikes will be allowed on the 30-plus miles of the Sioux Falls Greenway trail system. The idea was originally proposed by former council member Greg Neitzert and current member Sarah Cole. E-bikes have been a game changer for people um, that want to just get out and get active. Um, sometimes it's just a matter of we're just getting a little older, uh, we just might have a little bit of mobility challenge, or just a difference in, in uh, athletic ability. Class 1 e-bikes are already permitted on sidewalks and trails. Both allow the motor to reach up to 20 miles per hour. But Class 2 does not require the rider to be pedaling. Allowing Class 1 and 2 e-bikes on shared use trails while keeping out faster motorized vehicles expands access for e-bike riders and maintains a safe environment for all trail users. Some trail users we talked to said they were indifferent about the change. Other trail users who didn't want to be on camera said they still have concerns about e-bike riders following the speed limit. We will be monitoring the trail and it comes back to also the other trail users to be courteous, respectful, but also when they see something to say something because we won't know about a problem unless someone shares it. The trail speed limit is 15 miles per hour. Class 3 e-bikes remain prohibited. In Sioux Falls, Carly Phillips, Kelloland News. Parks and Recreation is partnering with the Sioux Falls Fire and Police Departments to provide educational social media content on how to safely use an e-bike.